Now those are some snazzy shoes. Look good, play good, right? Those American kicks belong to Aussie Scott Head, who fired off the lowest round of the week with his 63 on Saturday at the World Golf Championships Bridgestone Invitational. Hen said he just wanted to pay tribute to the American military. I say, that's a pretty nice guy. Maybe he should wear them again Sunday because they sure were working in round three. He started his day off with a birdie from 26 feet on the first. Putt after putt going wow. in at one. Then ended his day with his eighth birdie and just one stroke back of the lead. Oh, hello. <laughs> if it's not the shoes, maybe it's the peanut butter sandwiches. Tommy Fleetwood with a tasty 47 footer on the eighth. Unbelievable birdie. I don't know what's more impressive, that putt or the fact that he ate about 16 PB&Js on Friday. Check this out, Rory McIlroy isn't going anywhere. The 2014 champ here at Firestone got the crowd fired up on the 12th. Watch out, uh, Mr. Peters, or Rory's got the bit between his teeth now. So did Matt Kuchar earlier in the day. He's relentlessly getting up and down. There's like a this? Shot. Whoa. Yeah, that was dead center. <laughs> He's gonna stay in the crowd. Those guys didn't need their putter, but Jimmy Walker broke his out from under the tree. Oh, the putter. Wow. I'm surprised he wouldn't just go over a metal wood and just uh, just try and twang it and try and get it back to the fairway. Look how close that was for Charlie Hoffman. Two strokes back, Charlie Hoffman found himself on the edge. And you might not believe it, but he made birdie from there. Kind of got like excited at the bottom. I would too. Just try not to fall in. Speaking of making birdie from there, co-leader Thomas Peters made birdie from the wrong fairway. That's right. That's his approach from the third fairway on the second hole from 245 yards en route to four birdies in his first five holes. This kid is very special. You know things are going your way when you talk to your ball and it listens. Go in, I heard. Oh, beautiful shot, 138. <laughs> okay, it didn't quite go in there for co-leader Zach Johnson, but you get the idea. Ah, Barracuda, the tournament where the script is flipped and high scores are the goal. This week in Reno, PGA Tour pros are aiming for the highest score during the Stableford Scoring System event. Over 40 points at one time in his round, leader Greg Owen was dialed in and almost gave us our second ace of the week. Oh, plus, oh, there you go. In second, trailing by five points, Derek Fathauer with a 43-footer on 15. Stuart Appleby is in the hunt and had an interesting discussion and tactic on 17. Just take a listen. What is it for? Left or right or what is it for? Left? Definitely gonna be we got to put some right. stank on it. Yeah, that's fine. I've heard him say, just got to smoke it, and then he said, put some stank on it. Is that what stank looks like? Anyway, happy Sunday. You can watch golf all day long, starting with the WGC Bridgestone Invitational on PGA Tour Live at 9, 10 a.m. Eastern Time, followed by the Barracuda Championship on Golf Channel. And I'll see you Monday for a recap of what's trending on and off the course in Trending on Tour.